prophase. During this stage, the nucleus of the cell undergoing mitotic division enlarges. Chromosomes become prominent in the nucleus. The genetic material of each chromosome is doubled. Each chromosome is divided into two chromatids. The centromere is not divided. The centriole is also divided into two. They migrate towards the opposite poles. The centrioles form the spindle fibers. Such fibers create the bipolar spindle. At the end of this stage, nuclear membrane gets dissolved. Metaphase Now the chromosomes are arranged on the equatorial surface. In a chromosome, the two chromatids and the centromere separate by a longitudinal slit. The centromere of each chromatid becomes separate and attaches itself to the spindle fiber. Anaphase Due to the contraction of the spindle fiber, each chromatid migrates towards its own pole. Now each chromatid is known as a chromosome. Telophase The chromosome reaches to the pole from the equator due to the pulling of the spindle fibers and forms a new nucleus. The number of chromosomes remains diploid or 2n, which is an important fact. Division of cytoplasm. This is the last stage of cell division. During this phase, the construction is formed in the cytoplasm between two nuclei, which are formed by nuclear division. It enlarges slowly up to the cell membrane. In this way, two daughter cells are formed from one mother cell.